our last day here in San Juan. We are headed back to El Yunque National Forest to climb Mount Britain. I'll explain more in just a minute, but we're about to leave and our flight leaves at 3.30 in the morning. Yay, so we've got a fun day plan. It's just very little sleep tonight. <laughs> So the original plan was for my brothers to climb up to the peak at El Yungay National Forest, but then we were going to go to the beach. So, but instead we found this Mount Britain. It's another tower, like the tower we saw yesterday, but this one is at like a higher elevation and it's only 0.8 mile. So you climb 2,500 feet elevation in less than a mile and then the incline is 500 feet. So not too bad. We're all gonna try it, except my mom. And it's only a 45 minute trail. So I read up on it and mo it's mostly pa paved, paved, yes, paved. And um, and it has three resting areas. So I think I'll, I think I'll be able to do it. I think I will. Um, I was supposed to be training for something else this summer we were gonna do in Colorado, but thankfully we're not doing that this time. I'm kinda glad, I gotta get more training in there. So. We're gonna head to the National Forest again, do that trail, and then head to a really pretty beach. the first resting point. <laughs> cars driving on this thing. We missed something. <laughs> We did it and I'm glad we did it. My face is so red. <laughs> we met these sweet people on top and it was fun just talking to people, especially with that mask on, no offense. My dad made it and now it's all downhill from here, which I will appreciate, but it's harder on his knees, but definitely worth it. Definitely, definitely. Now, if you are out of shape, totally out of shape, I don't, know if you, I don't know if you can make it to be quite honest with you. I mean, I'm not in shape whatsoever, but I have been working out, so that has helped a ton. So definitely worth the Mount Britain Trail. So that trail, it goes all the way up there to the Pico El Unic Peak. Not having it, it's another hour. But the girls that we just saw, they were gonna climb it. Kudos to them. And also this is the zip line tower for zip line, which I think is so cool. Little tip, as you're passing people, encourage them. And you know, just tell them, you got this, you got this. And people really enjoy that as I'm coming down. 
And honestly, I have to say the last five minutes was probably the hardest part for me because it's almost not totally straight up, but yeah, last five minutes is the hardest part. But if you can do the rest of the way, you can do it. We did it. I, need a I feel like I've accomplished something huge in my life. I survived. <laughs> I loved it. So now we are eating at the El Yunque Tree House. It's supposed to be very authentic. As we wait for our food, Noah, do you think the hike was worth it? If I land this, uh, John, you can get Noah, was the hike worth it? Yes. Uh, uh, you're going to fit no. Noah, Micah? It was worth it. It was a good hike. Yes. Dead to forever. Dead to forever. all the time. That's okay. The water all the time. The time's tired. You're buying coffee because I bought yesterday. Look at these parrots and at the restaurant. Hi. Hi! <laughs> this guy's going nuts. Hi! You don't touch the man's tail. No. I touched it. Don't. They gonna get you. This guy's going crazy. Hey. Hi! Hi! Um, he knows he can't fly. Hello! Oh, you love clouds, they get no room. Oh, excuse you. What seems to be the problem? I oh, know. I oh, know. Are you not getting any attention? Yeah. I oh, know. Never, ever, ever, ever go to that restaurant. From the time we sat down to the time we got our food was an hour and a half. An hour and a half. Hour we, we watched somebody leave. It took him, what, 15 minutes to get our drinks, and all we did was order water and two lemonades. Okay. And then our food, it was basic. Like, uh, mm -mm. And, it was, and it wasn't, like, fantastic. Like, it looks like a really nice restaurant, and it's not all it's cut out to be. It was the slowest place on this planet. So, negative. Don't ever come here. At the beach. We are starting to pack and have to leave tonight on well, 3.30 in the morning. Um, so after we went to the, we spent time at the ocean, we came back to our condo and we were all going to shower because we all, you know, the salt and just, ugh, you know, and we're like, wait, there's 30 more minutes till, you know, of our pool time that was open. So we thoroughly enjoyed it. It was a 70 degree pool. It was nice and warm. It was just so nice. And then I took my mom to see the uh, sea turtle area like I just showed y'all and uh, she loved seeing that and just you know we were told that you know, my dad did some research that this is one of the most beautiful beaches and honestly like because of all the kelp and it just stinks after it's rotting there for a while it just it's not it takes away from the beauty of it um so uh anyway so I'm gonna give this ho this condo a rating in the next vlog but I'm gonna end this vlog here because we're packing up trying to get things together um yeah, we're doing last minute laundry so we can take clean clean laundry home, but I can't believe this is it. Like we've had so much fun, so many memories, and I definitely want to explore the west side of the island. We stayed on the, no, I'm sorry. We stayed on the west side. I want to explore the east side of the island next time. And then I'll be done. Like I don't, you know, I don't really care to ever, I actually have to come here, you know, so. Um, but thank you so much for watching and make sure you subscribe.